Hey everyone, welcome back to our channel. Today, we have an amazing tutorial on how to create an SSH WebSocket account and set up an HTTP custom app. For more VPN hidden tricks, make sure to visit our blog. If you're new to our channel, don't forget to like, subscribe, and share. Let's get started. First, open your favorite web browser and search for SSH Ocean. Click on the official link to reach the website's homepage. Keep in mind, this website might be unavailable at times, but when it is, their servers work really well. So don't get frustrated if the website is slow sometimes. Once you're on the homepage, click the menu button in the upper right corner to expand the menu list. From the list, click on services and a new window will open. Click on SSH WebSocket, which will take you to the location page. Here, choose your desired location and click on it. The page will display available servers in that location. Ensure the server you choose is not offline and then click the Create Now button. On the final page, enter a username and password, complete the CAPTCHA and click the Create Now button. In just a few seconds, you'll have successfully created your account. Once your server is created, copy the IP or host, port 80, username and password. Also, note down the HTTP payload. Next, we'll need to download the updated HTTP custom app. Go to your device's Play Store and search for HTTP Custom. In the search results, click on it, then click the Install button to download it to your device. Once the app is downloaded, click Open to reach the app's home screen. On the home screen, click the hamburger icon in the upper left corner to expand the menu. In the menu, click on SSH Settings and enter the data you copied earlier. IP, port 80, username, and password. Once you've successfully added this data, Click the hamburger icon again to expand the menu and click on Payload. Paste the payload you copied earlier, then click the Apply button. After setting everything correctly, click the Connect button to secure a fast and browsing internet connection. If you found this tutorial helpful, please like, subscribe, and share it. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video.